this is what I hope is going to be a simple fix to a scroll saw problem. So stick around. Hi, I'm Paul. Welcome to my messy workshop. This is my DeWalt 788 scroll saw. Now I bought this saw used. It needed some work. Um, I got it at a good price, so I bought it. One of the things that was missing on the saw is right over here there's supposed to be a little sawdust blower that comes around by the blade and blows the sawdust out of the way. Well, you can order that part from DeWalt or from e-parts and it's about 26 bucks. Uh, I didn't want to spend that much money so I looked into some other methods of putting a hose on there. I found that Lockline offers a quarter inch hose that is almost exactly the same thing that you get from DeWalt except this is blue and the one from DeWalt is black. The kit from Lockline included two pieces of their flexible hose, a couple threaded fittings which we don't need, and some tips for the end for the air to come out. This kit was in the neighborhood of eight bucks. Also, they offer a pair of pliers that help put this stuff together. Uh, you can heat it up and push it together, but uh, from what I've read, the pliers make it a lot easier. So for around $10, I bought the pliers also. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to move the camera in so I can show you how the lock line goes together and goes on the saw. This is the fitting right here that this uh, air hose goes on. And I'm going to try and get the pliers on so you can see what I'm doing here. I guess that's about as good as I can get it. And then you just squeeze and the players push that piece on there and it's on. And all you do again, and that snaps it together. And that's all there is to putting that hose together. Now, let me just bend it out of the way and we'll put this fitting on. Snap that on and it just snaps right in place. And there's our blower, sawdust blower hose all installed. Well that's all there is to it. I now have a nice flexible line on my scroll saw and it's a lot cheaper than if I'd have bought the replacement one from eParts or from DeWalt. I'll put a link down below in the description on how to get these. Um, I ordered them right from Amazon. It's really easy. This is a, called a quarter inch line and I think that refers to the inside diameter is a quarter of an inch. Well that's all I've got and uh, just want to let you know I sure appreciate your watching.